Good morning, good morning. Um, Natalie from Lion.Arrow has a lovely, lovely challenge in her group. It started on the 5th and ends on the 19th. Now, I did a video for this before this. I did it just before. I did it on around about the 3rd. But um, since then, a few things have changed. So I've come back in again because there's another kit I want to show you as well. So the challenge is, is to make a folio. Okay, now in her group, she has three folios that you can use to make it with. Okay, these are in the file section and they're freebies. Okay, so you've got this one, this gorgeous greeny colour. I just love that. It's got that, that lovely bluey turquoisey colour to it as well and a brown one. So you've got three that you can start with. Okay, now the kit to win is called Enchanted Forest, okay, and it's this one. And I actually used this one to make mine with to showcase how beautiful it is. And it's on sale at the moment, 30% uh, off. I think it was 170 or 190. It's really, really cheap. When I say that, it's in pounds. So you're looking at about $250, something like that. Absolutely stunning. I love the imagery. Look, we've got Happy Feet and he's doing his little dance. Bless him. We love Happy Feet. I don't know how many times I've seen that move with my grandkids, but on my days, Levi used to love it. Beautiful, aren't they? Natalie has the most gorgeous style. She really does. And they are such beautiful, beautiful images. And you've got the bannies. I love them bannies. And of course, I love deers, obviously, you know, being here. There's so many deers here. We love them. And we've got a lot of badgers as well. And then we need owls. My dad used to keep owls many, many moons ago. And the birds. Oh, isn't it lovely? Absolutely gorgeous. Such a beautiful, beautiful kit. And that's why I used it. And I thought, well, at least I can then showcase it so you guys can see exactly what the kit's like that you could win. Now... In this kit, you get the folios too. So you get a folio in this one too. So what I did was I've used this with one of the freebies, okay? Which I'll show you shortly. And then the additions that you get in the kit, you've got a gorgeous big envelope there. Then there's the lovely pockets, tags, and this ephemera. Look at that bunny. They're absolutely gorgeous. I love this collection here. Absolutely lovely. And you can see it's all Natalie's own work as well. It's absolutely lovely. Um, Paulette Line.Arrow flashed up the other day about using um, kits that have fussy cuts in. Now, most kits nowadays have fussy cuts in but you need to read the TNCs when you look at it, you know, the angel policies of the original people. Because some people have been taking fussy cuts that other people have made, say graphics fairy, for example, and they've been they've not been altering them before they sell them as a fussy cut. Um it's quite a deep thing. If you want to know more about it, go into Paulette's group. Um Principles for your junk journaling with TLC and Paulette's there. She's more than willing to talk to people about it if you're worried about it or anything else. Um, and I just want to flash up now while I'm looking at Natalie's. Obviously, Natalie's, you can see they're all her own work. So there's no worries there. Um, but it's something to think about because the last thing you want is a designer on your case saying, you know, you've stolen that from me. And I'm thinking, no, I haven't. <laughs> OK, so just just a quick word on that. Now, last night I got this kit and this is her new kit and it's absolutely beautiful. Um, now I'm going to have to remember the flipping, make the name of it now. It's blue something. Uh, it's gone. I'll remember it in a minute. <laughs> but um, this is what happens when you've got men singing in the bathroom. We've got absolutely gorgeous florals in this one and it's so spring and you know it really makes you want spring to hurry up and come absolutely beautiful 
I just really love this. I really, really do. Gorgeous images. Absolutely stunning. I've double backed mine. That's why you, if you, you can see these on the corner here, it's because I double back them <laughs> so that I can make a journal with them. I absolutely adore this one. This one is definitely my favourite page. But the most gorgeous, gorgeous images. They really are. And then you have, again, the journal um, outlines. You know, so you've got one journal there. And love, not journal. File folders. <laughs> I'll put my teeth back in today. So you've got two file folders here. And I actually married them together this morning and aren't they gorgeous you can make such a lovely file folder out of this um i'll show you mine shortly but imagine you know you could put a booklet in the middle of this you know and then pockets it is lovely and that those images are beautiful so that's in there and then we've got these lovely big tags and then that the smaller tags Beautiful, beautiful cards. Look at those journaling cards. And then pockets. I love these pockets. Sorry. They seem to be sticking together today. And a couple more pockets. And washi tape and fusses. And then these beautiful uh, bits of ephemera here. Look at her little face. Absolutely gorgeous, isn't it? So, blue memories. That's what it's called, blue memories. It's all right, I'm, go I'm going dark with them. So that's Blue Memories, and that has only just gone into Natalie's shop. And again, this one is on sale. So if you want either of these kits, I would say go, in, go into a store, grab them now while they're on sale, store, uh, on sale. Put my teeth back in. They are absolutely beautiful. Um, I'm all of a dither because for the last over a week, it started last uh wednesday the workmen have finally turned up to do the bathroom um and i've been sending people pictures it started with monday when they went home monday they'd stripped the top floor off and everything and you could see all the clinker underneath the floorboards um because in the 70s they used to take the clinker and the ashes from the fires you know your coal fires and use them as soundproofing. Absolutely brilliant soundproofing. It really is. It's incredible. Um, and then come by the weekend, you know, when they left Friday, we'd gone down to a big hole where, you know, I could see downstairs um, and we had a communal bathroom. And then on Friday, they managed to get, um, you know, the joists in they replaced all the joists the whole floor has been has been replaced because as i said right going back about four years ago it's woodworm um once they've actually finished the bathroom completely they are sending the wood wood man out so he can spray wherever he thinks it might have traveled to hopefully it stayed in the bathroom i just hope that i really really do um but on monday i got a floor and a loo Oh, my days, I actually had a toilet. <laughs> so, things are looking up. Um, <coughs> they are amazing, these guys. They, they're not keep having a cup of coffee. They come in, they work straight through to lunch. They only take about 20 minutes lunch, and they're back in again, and they really work. But the only thing that makes me laugh is the fact that they um, listen to Radio Borders. I listen to Radio Borders too. And they're singing along with it. <laughs> so you're sitting in here and you're singing and they're singing in it. It's great. It's, it's, it's lovely. They are the nicest people I could ever have, have wished for to come and do all this work. So uh, that's why I'm a bit sort of up in the air. Not sure which day of the week I'm at. And I'm trying to get this video done before they come back off lunch. <laughs> that's what all the, the hurry is about. So this is my folio that I've done for the channel, for, for the challenge. Um, I've used my um, wax seals on here. I thought these were absolutely lovely. Um, and I absolutely love doing this. Uh, these are two of Natalie's tags. I've, I've just done a bit of sewing on it. This is very, very vintage lace and it comes from Windsor. Um, and you will remember that William got married there and Harry got married there you know, at Windsor Castle. Well, that is Windsor, you know, and it's a very, very small town. So that's come from Windsor. 
then on the inside and obviously this is the page that i've used this is the actual one that i've used i've used her folio from the kit and then on the inside i've used the blue one okay i've used the blue one on the inside because it married up so beautifully with the colors on there um the bits of paper that i was cutting off as i was making all this i've stuck a couple little strips up here like washi tape um that's one of the ephemera cards and I, I i just didn't you know sometimes you get these images and you really don't want to cover them up do you and I, I just thought that was so lovely here i've just got here this is from a very very old dictionary it's a school dictionary and you've got on there deer swift moving animal with hooves and horns the stag and the reindeer etc i thought it was quite nice to stick that on there and a bit more of that very very ancient it's actually antique not vintage um and i've got a little bit of uh, lace on there with our bear and let's pop them back in there and look at those bunnies i just love those bunnies faces i really do we always grew up with rabbits but then again on a sunday night my dad would gut one you know because it you know there were six kids in the family and that would means we were getting rabbit stew <laughs> but then that's what you did in the 60s you know um isn't that lovely these are just such perfectly lovely images um these are a couple of the smaller bits of ephemera from natalie and a bit more of that that antique lace in there and that's that lovely bunny i think it's such a lovely image that bunny and this gorgeous fox you know i i just I just sat and did it one day you know i saw the challenge and i thought oh i love that kit so much i'm going to go over and get it go and buy it and then you know make the folio and it got me back into crafting again i struggled in december i'm still not 100 percent, you know because i've still got this long covid but i'm getting into a better routine i'm able to sort of get better back at you know, I know where I'm going more. I don't have to think about things quite so hard. You know, it's it's all coming together again. So I, I'm really, really tickled pink. And this helped me so much. And here's our envelope. I made it a little bit smaller so it fit in here. This is the big envelope. Winter, the cold season of the year. Yes, we know the hat. And it says to spend the winter. And it says here, wintering in Italy. Um, so obviously in in Italy they must say uh, wintering. Uh, um, I've not heard wintering. Obviously winter and wintery, and I've obviously I've lined it with the birdie paper. It's a lovely, lovely envelope. It would be so nice to send that in a happy mail with a tag in. It really would. It's it's, it's a lovely, lovely envelope. And then this bit here, I decided that this would be perfect. Folded in half. I've backed it on the inside. And you could put that as a thank you note, thinking of you, just something like that. So you're using up all your ephemera um, just in the back there. I was thinking of making it into a tiny little notebook, but I thought then it's going to make the, this too bulky. You know, you don't want your folio being too bulky. So when I send this off to somebody, I can put a little note in there. Um, and these are the tiny ephemeras and another wax seal on the back. And I just really, really love this. This is why I wanted to bring it in to show you everybody on youtube and as i say when i did the original video i just showed the one kit and that's the kit that you're going to win um but i thought right well i've got this other kit that's got one of these in as well and i know a few of her kits do have a template in you know one of these in when you're making these you don't have to use two together stuck together i did that purely because that, that's what i was doing at the time you can just use any paper you like on the other side. So if you're using one from group, you can choose the lovely paper that you've got and literally just back it with that, you know. Um, I mean, the colours are fab and they will really, really go with virtually anything you've got, you know, any any papers that you've got inside. Um, I mean, I, I just love that colour. And the brown, that's so, so vintage-y, isn't it? Um, you know, I remember my first wallpaper when I first got married um, in the 70s and everything was brown and beige then. Everything was brown and beige. <laughs> you know, big patterns and brown and beige. <laughs> so do pop over to Natalie's group. Have a look at the challenges. 
she has several you know there's always something going on in there there's always a challenge going on and they're lovely and natalie gives some lovely things away you know she gives her kits away and that and they're just beautiful um and there is a hashtag so if you do make this make a folio pop it into the into the event so that you get it go into the draw then Pop it on your social media somewhere with a hashtag and it'll come up so everybody else can see it. If anybody else goes onto Instagram, they can put that hashtag in and they'll be able to find you. The same with on YouTube. And it'll activate more people coming through your channel, which I think will be a lovely idea. So, guys, I'm going to get off here quick before they come back and start drilling again. They are actually putting the uh, wet board up at the moment um, and they're boxing in all the pipes which is lovely you know they're making such an incredible job they really are um so hopefully when i speak to you next week i'll have a bathroom <laughs> and then the fun begins because because the, the woodworm man comes out when he's finished spraying the place i've then got to have the uh central heating done you know so roll on easter <laughs> love and blesses everybody um if you've not subscribed please subscribe um i want to do a giveaway at 1500 subbies and i'm not that far off i think about 80 off at the moment and i want to do a journal you know i like to give away a journal on, on the momentous uh members uh, subscribers i think that would be quite nice um i'm going to do the video when they go today of the giveaway that i'm doing I'm going to start this on Sunday and um, it's basically Zern gifted me a kit and it will be for this wee notebook um, and I will get that video up soon. Okay, so love and blessings everybody. Have an amazing day. I hope the weather's better than it is here. It is really grotty here at the moment. That's why that, you know, it's very dull trying to video, but have an amazing day. Take care and I'll see you all soon. Ta-da!